This girl some music. Mwah, 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 mwah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> All right, let's burn. Like we've known each other all our lives. Mm. Say, do you like to suck the centers out of stuffed jalapenos? Who doesn't? <laughs> hey, 
What are you saying? Can we get some? You read my mind. <laughs> Friends and I have a band. You do? Yeah, we're the friendly chartreuse bubblegum machine. Mundo, excelente. I'd love to hear you play. should be in the festival. You really think so? I know so. Hey, just a gosh darn second. Can your band hold their breath? Machines fought a big dumb dopey dope. <laughs> boys, boys, boys. Go stars!
Mark Calvin just went platinum, and Ted Brownman, <laughs> i.e. me, is putting you on Disco Rama. <gasps> Disco Rama, the, the most kitschy boss roof bang on the two. Stand by for Disco Rama. Here we go in five, four, three, two. Starts uh -oh. to wake it. That's it baby. After it gets dark, Get down, no. he's got the beaver fever. Beaver fever. Good job. Yeah. Well, beep, beep, beaver fever. Now, help me. Beaver over here. Beaver over there. Beaver over here. Nation. Beaver fever sweeps world. Beaver fever sweeps things that are bigger than that. It's a little thing I call old baby. When I look at you, you know, baby, when I look at you, I see you with both my eyes. When I touch you, I feel like I feel something.
live with the sun and knock down trees. With a belly full of biscuit and a lot of butter, if you please. Making stumps and cracking bark, we saw and chop until it gets dark. Then we eat some more. <laughs> Lumberjacks! They're chopping our trees, which are ours, not theirs! Now, Taggy, calm yourself. We knew this day would come. <laughs> calm, calm. A bunch of spooty headed lumber jerks are demolishing our forest, Norbut! <laughs> understand how you feel. We dangled from trees high above the roots With leather straps on our butts And shiny spike and boots Pounding pulp and slap and sap We... <laughs> Say, fellas! Do you smell that? That wet, moldy, musty, stinky, smelly, low-down smell of beavers! Beavers! Ah! Howdy, woodsman neighbor! Looks like a couple of germ-breeding tree-biting rats. A beaver's got no place. Worker lumber and that rats. Indeed. Come on, put him up, put him up. Come on. We don't want to be rude, but we would appreciate it if you would leave. Mm, that sounds reasonable. Face, no can do. We claim these trees for us, not you. But no dirty beaver, I've a better idea. A good old fashioned scrubbing from two Seven. Oh, mystical seven ball. Shh, shh. Oh, mystical seven ball. Just ask the question. What next? Strategy number two. <laughs> Infiltrate and exaggerate. <laughs> mm. Befriend your enemy, but then convince him that there is another place much better than your <laughs> place. Love it. <laughs> what are you nuts? Lumber jerks hate beavers. Oui, oui, bonjour. Yeah. Oh my, who is that we see? It is me, the legendary Canadian lover Jacques. Beaucoup bonjour, you see. It is. This is my legendary fur hat, Dickie. <laughs> We've come from a land that's way up north, where the nights are cold and the days are not so cold. It's an honor, my name's Lars, and here's my crew. Sven, Peter, Dieter, and Achim, too. So, Boku, tell us of where you are from. The trees are so big, it takes two days to walk around one. And all they talk. Mon Dieu, they scrape the sun when they fall. <laughs> well, by golly, that sounds like a magical place. Let's go now, I'll pack my suitcase. See what I tell you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, these guys are moraines, uh, morans. <laughs> Yes, we will go where the timber is fast. 
But first, we must have a hearty breakfast! Join us! Wee wee! <laughs> Flapsack. I'll take a stack. It's a coffee coming. Strong and black it is fighting and chewing and real loud slipping, breaking wind and real and burping. It's a lumberjack breakfast huzzah! Hey, uh, can I get some artificial sweetener over here? Uh, go. Uh, if you don't have any, that's all. Sugar, sugar, oh, ba da da are reading this, you asked for artificial sweetener. Okay, seven ball. What do you say I smash you into a billion pieces? Oh! Mystical seven ball. Great trash. Shh. What do we do? Ask again later. What? Give me that. No, Dad. Hey. Don't you see what the ball is telling us? Uh, it's time to resort to violence! That ball's finally coming around! Let's do it, baby! Dad, wait! We need to make a plan. Dad! I'm a germ breeding tree jumping rat. A beaver's got no place working lumber that's that. What have they done to you, Dad? They've broken you. They've worn down your spirit. It's go time, you lumber monkeys! Oh, look, boys, the beaver's back for more. Ew! Nobody makes my brother enjoy bathing and gets away with it. I challenge all you singing weirdos to a Timborama! Whoever fells the most trees in 30 seconds wins. And the losers must leave this forest and vow never to darken its hallowed, hollowed logs again. We accept, prepare to meet your defeat. it say? I can't believe you take advice from a plastic billiard ball replica. Dag, get my hammer. Ball peen or framing? Both. Indeed. Ha <laughs> ha! 
What's up, Dagzilla? <laughs> oh, 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 no, 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 nothing, nothing, uh, 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 nothing. from another dimension. An object from another dimension that feeds like an intergalactic moth upon the very fabrics of time and space. What is that? Sometimes when things look really, really bad, they really, really are! I want to go home right now. I'm scared. Now, now, there's nothing to be scared of. Well, this certainly is unpleasant. Oh. This place looks scarily spooky. <laughs> oh, bizarre and poo poo. Not poo poo, poo poo. Bad Cajun food? Whatever. Maybe someone here can help us. Come on. <laughs> okay, Teddy Buddy, you stay right here. Stop that. Are you talking to your teddy bear? At least I don't talk to a stump. Love. Hmm. Don't see that every day. You stop saying that. I must say, these guys know how to bot down. I must say, I don't like this one little bit, nor be not one little iota. How little? It's just like a little, little, little iota. Yeah, it's right. just like Night of the Semi Living Zombies who aren't half dead yet. These guys are zombies, I tell you! Dagger later, that was just a movie. They, they wouldn't put stuff in a movie if it wasn't true. What is going on here? 
This, sorry to barge in on your little hootin' in ya. It's hootin' any, right? Right, it's what I said. But we're lost and we need a little help. Why, you poor losties. Yeah. Oh, oh, beavers. <laughs> of course we'll help you. Allow me to introduce myself. Some folks call me the Swamp Witch, but you can call me Edgar. She is weird. Quiet. Hey! Are these bald guys zombies? Edgar. Zombies? Edgar. Zombies? <laughs> uh, they're my gentlemen callers. We're having a little party. Make yourselves to home. I'll be right back. See, they're very friendly. It's what you call Southern hospitality. You gotta learn to relax, my brother. Her name's Edgar. <laughs> Spooky, bad, 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 bad place. We have to get out of here. Hang loose, swamp daddy. Dig these down home blues. <laughs> Stop that! Are you coming or not? Not. Fine. Stay here in weirdo land. You fit right in. shouldn't judge people by their appearance. These guys are probably as normal as we are. What luck! Can you believe it? They just walked right in our door. Beaver teeth are the final ingredient I need for my ultimate hoodoo potion. Hey, where'd our beds go? Nice work, Dag. What? That was your spooty idea to do magic tricks. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Well, the next time I crack open Gallstone's Book of Magic and I want to do one, don't try to help. Well, I, uh, oh, 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 oh. Well, when the book said the hair would disappear, I thought they were talking about a rabbit. Hmm. Split. You know, go home. You'll have to excuse us, ladies. <laughs> We're just a little embarrassed about our bodily baldness. <laughs> it's embarrassed. It's more like... Oh, I know how you feel. Every year, Farmer Fanny shears us, and sometimes we feel embarrassed like you. But when we do, we just try to remember... Great buckets of spook norm they're gonna see.
I start? I want to start on this one. What? Are you starting? You uh, may be more sensitive, sensitive to a cool wind chill. <laughs> but in yeah, the, the free department, department, you're itching. It's Nothing. Neil. Nada. Sit down. Hush up. Although Come on, the dang. sun's rays may, may now hold a gun. Come on, buddy. SPF 3 oh. What's that mean, ladies? No more concern. I like it. Norbert, what are you doing? Oh, come on. Why don't you join in? Why don't you learn you the words? You could sit there and make fun of us, or you could sing you instead, and you have a lot more fun. You think just come out, out, and they come out, out right. It's the out, reason. Come out. on. Just give it a I shot. Want to. I won't it's gonna do it. start. I this is your shot. This is your last chance. I love that part. <laughs> hey, you did good. You did good. only one thing I hate more than being furless, right. and that's and singing, that's singing sheep. sheep. I know, but they do have eh. a point, Daggy Long. Are you crazy? Gallstone's eh. Book of Magic. Yep. Norby! Dang! Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the 12th Annual Water Show featuring Jupy, the well-organized seal. But 12th first, Annual Water Show? show? Featuring Jupy, the well-organized seal. Cool. Hey, Norbert, listen. Let's go home! This furless thing really bothers hey. you, huh? <laughs> come on, come on, let's go. And miss seeing Jupy? No way! <laughs> oh, did I do that? Jack, how long have we been away? <gasps> long ago, in an episode far away, two young beavers thought it would be a good idea to stay up all night. It wasn't. Accidentally unplugging their clock, they stupidly stayed up a bazillion years and really messed things up. This is the rest of their story. Oh, woe is us, Norby. We're stranded a bazillion years in the future. Unless, of course, something conveniently comes along to rescue us. Um, a convenient convenience. Hello, I am A times Space Fort A Party 2000 A. I take you back. Your own time space continues. Listen, everybody, to a tale you won't forget. About two beaver brothers named Norbert and Daggett. One day these two young hombres travel to the wild west to meet Kid Friendly, their hero, who was their sacred quest. Back in the old wild west, when people's heads was funny, the funniest head of all. Mess around with him. I can't wait to try my hand at a smile down with our favoritis gunfighter, Kid 
Friendly. Ooh. Isn't this the bestest dag slinger? No. Dagadillo, let's discuss. Uh -huh. I have to agree. Let's not go find Kid Friendly. No. Okay, don't not come. Eh. Okay. No. Yes. No. Hmm. Don't see that in the day. Wonder where all the friendly towns folk are. I don't. Of course you don't. Hello. Anybody here hiding in the saloon? Kid friendly. Just in case you forgot, Norbot, I'm going to say no to anything you say. And one close call would be enough to send a smart guy running. But Daggett never had the sense the good Lord gave an onion. No matter what Norm said or did, he just wouldn't hear. Wouldn't he? Kid Friendly meant to make him grin. From furry ear to ear. He'll kill you with kindness. He'll kill you with a Don't you mess around with him, you beavers. Oh, I, I think we lost him for now. No, we didn't. Dag, will you just stop it? Which has no small pieces. Toddlers can swallow and is completely non-imitatable. Hey, what the? Huh? <laughs> now, Norbert knew his brother couldn't take on old kid Presley. But he didn't want to hang around and wait till things got ugly. Ugly. Norman never really knew what Dag would do or say. But he knew if you smile and run, you live to smile another day. He'll kill you with kindness. He'll kill you with a grin. Don't you mess around with him. Stop the robot kid. Robot kid! There'd be a pair of smiling stiffs with undies unbundling. He'll kill you with kindness. He'll kill you with a grin. Kid friendly. Don't you mess around with him. where all the kids' victims are buried.
good mind to complain. Need new Herbert, I've got a better idea. Now this is big Western fun. No. Oh no. I feel my undies oh. riding up again. Oh no! Oh, yeah. Come on! I Get am, me baby. Up, Here they go. Get me oh, out of yeah. here! Here it comes, baby! Yeah, baby! Yeah, baby! So if you're gonna ride the range and shoot and rope and spit, take a lesson from these beavers and make sure your undies fit. The beavers got kid friendly had a real close call. This is where the story ends. Or maybe not. After all. He'll kill you with kindness. He'll kill you with a grin. Kid friendly. Don't you mess around with him. You beavers. Next up on Nick Not at Night, it's Dagsky and Norb. In Not Tonight's episode number 337, Word on the Street, Dagsky and Norb fight bad guys, which is what cool cops do. Nick Not at Night, preserving our classic Tiwi heritage. Get your head on straight and keep your eyes on the skies. There's two cool cops in town, so don't be surprised. It's that ski and That's he and the Yeah, man. a fast driving cat who never slows down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Norm's working for the man. But he still gets around. We can dig it. I knew you could. Yeah, yeah, Get yeah, back to yeah, Friday. Yeah, yeah. You too, Beretta. Cool and coaching. Move over, Mod Squad. You know who's on the scene. It's that scene. Say it again. That scene. And that's the stone coach. Tonight's episode, Word on the Street, baby, solid. Yeah. <laughs> Darn hippie protesters. Well, but this time, I get to drive. Why, I oughta. Are you... carping? <laughs> 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 do we have here? Ooh, mama! Take a look at this one, Dan! Ooh, 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 I got lung between us, y'all. Mom's got a secret that nobody knows. When she's not washing windows or cleaning dad's clothes, she's the mom from Mongo.
you. And someday, I'm gonna donate your brain to science. Hey! Maybe they're collecting door-to-door! -door. Great Googly Mugly! How she Baba and Wula Boga! Daggy. We're over! <coughs> How could they? <coughs> Them! Those guys do this to me, moi, myself! <coughs> I mean, Darbert. I can understand Daggett being over. He's Darby. almost over here. It looks like he's Darby choking anyway, Darbert. but not the Narborator! The Narboronski! <laughs> the big one! The brother! The legend! There is no dog! There is no dog! <laughs> uh, oh. Nope. That was nursey! No, that was cartoony! <laughs> Madufi brother? Why? We're going bye bye Bye-bye. Why-why? Because we are over! Uh, over? Over what? Over! Is in done, hey. through, finished, hey. ended, ah. terminated, ah. day funked, hey. extinct, Ooh. extinguished, oh. down for the count, ah, one, two, out of badness, hey. signing off, saying sayonara, finito, ah. completo, adios, sending this dog to Montana, <laughs> going bye bye. I don't get it. Of course you don't. I've never told you this before because I was afraid your tiny and feebled mind couldn't combobulate it. We are a cartoon. Ah. We aren't real. We're animated characters in a cartoon. Real beavers don't have appliances. Yeah. They don't use bathrooms. And they don't talk. Poor things. Technically, we're an optical illusion. Observe. Hey, get away with your evil magic. It's not evil magic. Whatever you say. Just wait here while I gather an angry mob to burn you at the stake. What the? Starting to get the picture? No. We're pictures! Huh? We're not even three-dimensional! Wowzers! I hate to break it to you. Hey! You're actually not even one-dimensional. <laughs> Ooh, hey, 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 Norby. Look, watch it. Check, 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 check it out. Ready for this? Now you see me? Now you don't. <laughs> Boy, I can't wait to try this out the next time I fight Trucky. I hate Trucky. You don't get this, do you? See me? Don't. See me. Don't. See me. Don't. See me. <laughs> don't. See me. Don't. <laughs> uh, so Wacky Quacky, the mallet wielding duck. My favorite cartoon. Of course, I'm more sophisticated in my patois. But in many ways, we're just like them, Dag. Let me show you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> whatever you say, evil magic brother of mine. Zowie! You could say that again. Zowie! If I knew you'd moved there, I'd have told you. Norb, is there something you're not telling me? Come along, brother. <laughs> Time to visit one of my incredibly huge secret rooms that conveniently appear in our dam whenever I need them. Yeah, I was wondering about that. Moo! Destructive testing. Ooh, sounds constructive. Remember all those times massive amounts of electricity have coursed through our bodies? Uh, Pressurized gases have blown us up like balloons. Uh, it's coming back to Noxious, me. toxic substances have coursed down our throats. No, Large yes, I objects remember that. have fallen on our heads, and huge explosions have blown us to bits. Yes. Well, here we go again. That was nuts. Nuts? Yeah. This is what really happens when that stuff happens to real people. <gasps> Ah, turn it off, Norby! For the love of Todd, turn it off! Oh, yeah. <laughs> that wasn't at all Peter Beaver friendly. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Excuse me while I embark on a crime spree. How did you? <laughs> Who did you? What? What did you? Wake up and smell the Korean ink and paint! We're cartoons, man! Hey, Norby. Beaver thing. Uh, Norby? Uh, Weasel. Uh, yes. Uh, your evil magic is becoming eviler. I give up. Oh. We're a cartoon in entertainment and divertissement. Uh, if I you can't right, accept what? that, too bad. I, I mean, the, like, the real tragedy here yeah. is that the world will be deprived of my creativity and dynamic personality. Maybe, maybe if they had promoted the show. I think so. Yeah. That would have helped. That was it's their loss. <laughs> Farewell, brother. Farewell. I'm off to be over. Uh, Hopefully, wherever over is, my genius will be appreciated there. Hey, before you go get appreciated, put the rest of my arm back. I don't know if we have that on a cable budget. Norm, 
Yeah. Uh, I don't want you to panic, but something different is going on. That's what I've been trying to tell you, Rich. Observe. Yeah. <laughs> Our world is an illusion. <gasps> the creation Rich. of a team of sensitive, gifted artists, talented voice artists. Like you, Nick. And like you, Richard. Thank you. And a few hack writers. And now, little buddy, it's all going away. They do. Going away? No, 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 no. It can't. I'll show those artists sensitivity. Calm down, mighty stallion. Okay. It's not their fault. It's not. They're as sad to see us go as we are. Are you sure about that? Oh, oh yeah, because listen, right now they, yeah. like you, uh -huh. are moving from the first stage of a cartoon being over, uh -huh. denial, right. to the second stage, <laughs> anger. Ah, Salem, where did those come from? <laughs> Salem. <laughs> <laughs> visual aids provided by our now friends the oh, wow. they'll go away soon <laughs> see no i mean yes i mean i'm i mean i mean i'm so confused i mean i'm gonna kick me some show being over guys as behinders no dag you no. can't what the <gasps> I mean, <gasps> hold on daggy hold on to what i meant emotionally not literally oh hold on richard okay nick now i mean literally <laughs> oh Oh, yes. 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 Hey, 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 Nick. Yeah, what is it? Rich? Maybe we can reason with these spooty cartoon being over guys. You know, give them something valuable like cash money or or postage stamps or mm -hmm. or or some autographed pictures. Or or if we can't reason with them, maybe we can just pretend to and then kick their bahooties. Congratulations, Dag almost gone it. <laughs> You've reached stage three of being over. <laughs> Bargaining. <laughs> I'm not bargaining. <laughs> I'm bribing. <laughs> Ooh, bribes, bribes, bribes. I'm wearing bribes, bribes, bribes. <laughs> Nick, uh, Norb, uh, or Salem, no, but... where did we put those bribes? <laughs> Richie Dag, what? we don't have any bribes. Uh, All we have is cartoon stuff. Oh. See, these aren't even real. <laughs> Ow. Besides, the cartoon being an over guys, it could have as many of our things painted as they want. But what if we give them... No, Dag. But I got Just those... do bargaining. <laughs> Accept our fate. Accept? It's the way of the world, hey. Dale. After all, the cartoon being over gals always know what's best. I mean, they made good television of science. Ha, uh, gee, boy, this is sort of a bummer track, Wally. There, there. Where, where? Ah, uh, yes. Hey. The next stage of being over. What's that? Unhappiness. Richard Agge. Yes? It's only Richard natural Agge. to be unhappiness you know, <laughs> about being over. You know what the most unhappiness Nisi thing about being over <laughs> is, Nicky Norb? What's that? I'm not going to get to kick the spooty cartoon being over guys' behinders. Mm. It's a good thing we're over, Nicky Norb. It sure would be hard living here without our stuff. Congratulations, Dagamahark. Hey. You've reached the final level of being over. I have. Acceptance. No. Are there any more of these spooty black card thingies? That's the last. You know, Norbnik, yeah. you're the swellest brother a cartoon could ever have. Dare I say it one last time? You dare. Big hug! Oh, <laughs> Come on in here! Oh, at least I won't have to go through this again. <laughs> Norby! What's that? Our series is about to flash before our eyes. Oh, Hang on, tag a reckoning, Richie boy. Ah, oh, boy, this is a pathetic pulling of the heartstrings for all of our viewers. Norby, what happens when you're over? Oh, it's not so bad. No? If a cartoon's good, even if it isn't. It's rerun incarnated. Ooh, does that hurt? No. Oh. Only when you get the later checks. The cartoon <laughs> being over guys rerun it over and over, and they make lots of well-deserved money. Which they share with the people who made the cartoon, right? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. So you see, it's all for the better. Right. Even though we're vanishing, uh -huh. we'll be back over and over again at virtually no cost to the network. That's great, Norby, yeah. Nick. Yeah. Nick. It's <laughs> like immortality without having to show up. Up every day. Exactly. Time to say bye bye, Daggy. Bye bye, Daggy. Hey, Spoot, I thought there weren't any more of these card thingies, Norby Nick. Last one, Dag. I promise. Now that it's over, Norb Nick, I've got one thing I've always wanted to say. Shut up! <laughs> oh, Dag. Yeah. We forgot one thing. Oh, that's right. April, April Fool! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>